In this tutorial I will show you how to create database and create table on SQL Server. Please like share and subscribe, let's start. Click on start menu. Right down here. SQL Server Management Studio click on it. So this will open the SQL Server Management window and need to connect the server local host. Click on Connect. Left side under Object Explorer, see Databases. So here System Database and Database Snapshots now no databases create here. Right now I don't have any database here. So go to top. And click on new query. So this will open this one. We need to first create database. Database syntax. Create database database name. Write create database and then write database name learning. End of this query put semicolon. Select the query and from top click on execute. So you see comments. Completed successfully. And so if you go in Object Explorer and select databases. And then click. Refresh so you will see the learning database create here. Create a table next. Before that, we need to write which database we need to use. Syntax for using database. Use database underscore name. Learning. Select and execute. Successful, so it's fine. Syntax for create table. Create table table underscore name. Column 1 data type, size. Column 2 data type, size, dot. Create table employees. A table structure comprises with column names, data types, and constraints like not null, primary key. Then add column names with data type. Enter and put tab will write the column's name. First write employed ID with integer data type not null and set as a primary key. Comma and then add second column name. First. Name. Var car. 30. Not null means no empty values for name and then comma. Then. Last name. Varchar 30 not null and put comma. Then fourth column job name. Write Varchar 30 not null comma. and then add fifth column salary. Decimal. Not null. And then complete bracket and put semicolon. So select everything from bottom to top. And then go here and execute. Make sure you are in the learning database from here. And then execute comments complete successfully. And when you go to Object Explorer under here learning database. Refresh the database learning. Under table. You will see the employees table created here. So all the column names are created here.
so I will show in the next tutorial how to insert data on the created table. If you like this video content, please like share and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching.